guys and welcome back so today we are off christmas shopping um to some like local garden centers there's a couple sorry about the crunching in the background ren's eating a piece of toast um but there's a couple of things that i need to get like little bits of decorations and stuff and you can say hi yeah say hi <laughs> Um, so we're just going to pop and get those and yeah, just have a look um, around and maybe treat yourself. Are you okay? Do you want to be on camera? Is that why? Yeah. Oh, you diva. Um, yeah, treat ourselves to some lunch or something. So I will turn around and show you guys what I'm wearing. So um, I've just shoved on this um, satin slip, which is from the... Lorna Lux collection and I've also got her um, navy knitted jumper on um, so yeah it's just a really really nice look I've also shoved on my Dior sling back pumps the cat's in here now um, I don't know whether I will wear these or I might just change into do you okay oh yeah okay okay you okay yeah okay good um and i've also got my dior saddle bag um <clears throat> yeah i think i might swap my shoes into something like a bit more casual a bit comfier um but yeah it's such a really really nice like loungy like easy to wear um outfit are you singing That's lovely singing. Um, we're just having a bit of a panic because the car is saying no key card detected and the key is in the car. So we might not make it to our shopping trip. Um, we may break down before then. We'll see. <laughs> These are such a cute idea for like a Christmas present, but we don't have any family here, so we wouldn't be able to get them over. But like for $16.99, I think that's an amazing price. Why are they so cute? How are you, doggy? What is it? Is that a doggy? Don't pull oh, it. Yeah. Just say hi. No, don't pull him. No. <laughs> He's no, attached. No, no. He's attached, baby. Are you doing your shopping? Yeah. Oh, make sure you check yourself out in the mirror first. Okay. <laughs> have you seen anything nice? Yeah. What have you seen? Are you going to put it in your basket? These are really cute idea too. You can choose like a heart or um, like a plain bottle and then you can like tailor the different oils to go inside. I think that's a really, really cool gift idea. And look, there's loads of little different, I need some of these because Ren has broken out, so I'm gonna take some black ones. Oh, I love these with the little birds on, aren't they so cute? And the twirly one. <laughs> what have you found? Just have a look at some gin glasses. <laughs> have you not got enough? <laughs> <laughs> These candles are quite nice. I like the pomegranate or the midnight patchouli. Which one do you like best? Mm. Both are nice. That one would go better. Okay. Mm, they? They're only £10.50 and they're massive. They would last for ages. Nice. Put this in. When are you going to put this in your basket? There we go. That's it. Come on then. You're getting a bit heavier now. 
How cute are these? Little like saucer crackers. They're such a good idea to just put like on the corner of like obviously your saucer or um, if you're having a cup of coffee or a cup of tea or something. I think they're so so cute. And we've got them in two designs. Is this your favourite section? Oh, he's got a mask on. He has. Are you okay? Are you okay, doggy? Don't touch him, just stroke him nicely. Should we go see the reindeers? Yeah. Come on then, let's go find the reindeers. So, these are really similar to what I have on my tree, but they've got like two tones of gold. And they also have some really nice like leaves and stuff. They look so, so pretty. I love the all gold tree. Um, but I've had my decorations for quite a while, so I don't think I will be changing anytime soon. I love this hot air balloon too. I wonder if they do it like in a silver. I really wish we had somewhere to put some little trees like this. Um, I mean, we could probably cram them in front of our door, but I don't think we'd be able to get through the door. But Ren loves the little deer. You can't get to them anymore. Ren. Ren, come here. I need um, here. I know. I need some battery powered lights. What about something like this that two way adapter instead of getting <laughs> Do we need an extension? Um me have a look. All these look like they are for trees. I just need like a little battery pack. Um, well, look at the little Robin family. <laughs> so cute. Oh, I love his little tartan bow. How cute is he? It's quite expensive though, 40 pounds. I think I paid like Ten pounds of mine from B and M, and I could probably just put like a tartan there. I think this is what I'm needing. So I really like the warm white ones. Um, these are mains powered though, and I want something that's battery powered. Okay, so I've finally found the battery power ones and I think I might go those ones are 20 lights, these ones get 50. I think I'm gonna go for these ones. Um and I think I might take two if that's not enough I will just bring one back um but I don't want to end up with not enough lights so I'm just gonna take two of those. Um, they're actually quite good. Oh wait, oh, they've sold out of the ones that have more lights. They've only got them in the white or the multicolour, but I really want the warm white. So they're just going to have to buy two packs of these. I really love these as like a little table decoration idea. I think they would look so cute with like little tea lights on. They've got them in like a uh, pewter a bronze and a silver and oh yeah like they put them on a the Christmas tree that's a really cute idea but I think I would use them as like little table decorations for Christmas day but we're not having Christmas here I don't think um, but if we were I'd probably get some of those for our table oh my god I love that a huge lamp <gasps> I bet it's a fortune though yeah it's like Yeah, it's 200 pounds, trust me, trust me. Are you okay? I am. Do you like that? <laughs> Which one do you like best? This one? Yeah. Hey, babe. You give me a hand? Ren, give me a hand. Come on, baby. Ren. <laughs> I love these like coppery baubles. They're so like autumn-y. I really, really love them. And this <gasps> spotty bauble. 
if only my tree was orange but I'm not changing it anytime soon but they have some really gorgeous decorations and these like creamy multi-packs are really nice fillers I think my mum saw this when she came and she really wanted it because it's um, got three stars on. I love these mini trees. They've got them in silver too. I think I prefer the plain wood. You could literally just like hang them in your window. They're so, so cute these are really nice as well i love them with the little branches in they're really really nice and rustic like if you wanted that like rustic feel it's a really really nice one <sighs> again look at these browns i really wish i could just do like a really autumny vibe tree but i think my husband would kill me if i bought any more <gasps> yeah i think this is the one i'm gonna get they have it in silver so I'm gonna get that for my mum to know that she really really wanted it they've also got some tree toppers um, I'm not too sure I think it actually might look quite nice when it's on but it's the same kind of stuff as what we've got so I mean it doesn't feel as heavy but I don't know if it would stay on that's the only thing I probably have the same problem that I do now so I might give that a miss Oh my god, this is literally like my weakness. Onion shaped baubles. <gasps> How stunning are they? And as you can see, look, they also do some roses. So if you didn't like the um, poinsettia look, you could always go with some roses um, instead. I really like this ribbon. I don't know whether to go for this one for my garland. Um, but I think that it might like shred dust like can you see all the little bits coming off there um but i do really like this white one. Oh, boo hey. Hi. <laughs> how much is it it's like four pound though um and i think i'd probably only get one bow so it would be about 12 pound for all my bows i'm just gonna have a look and see what else there is i might come back um because it would make some really nice big bows but um i'm gonna have a look around and see what else i can find This is another really cute idea for um, your table. I um, have seen some hydrangeas in this colour that I'm getting to go in a vase in my living room. Well, I haven't decided whether I'm getting this colour or just plain white, but um, they would look so nice together. How stunning is this? Such a clever idea for any of you fashion girls out there. Here's another idea for your Christmas tree so so creative I love it I really love all these colors too I think we saw a similar display last year in another garden center and they called it like sugar plum fairy but I really love um, these like pale and like sagey green colors of the pink I just think it's a really really nice like pastel vibe um, but they've also like mixed in like some lilacs and other stuff so I'm just looking for ribbons to make um, bows for my garland and I picked up this, I was trying to go for silver but I do really love, I don't know if it's focusing, I do really love this kind of mesh pinky colour, let me see if I can focus, um, this mesh like rose goldy colour, um, I did want to stay away from blue because all my bows at the minute are blue so I wanted something that tied in with my current decorations that's something a bit different but I do really love this. So we've been chucked out now because Gavin said we've bought more than we're supposed <laughs> to buy. We literally hardly have anything but so we're going to get some lunch. Should we going to get some lunch? Nah. No. No. Do you need a nap? Are you tired? Hey guys, so I've had something to eat and I'm feeling a bit better now. Um, so I've also had some cocoa de mole and um, a cup of tea. So I'm kind of um, re-energized. <laughs> so um, I've popped my PJs on. These are like my favorite PJs. They are so, so comfy. They are 
nine by savannah west i got them for christmas last year and they i think she does the same kind of design but just like different um patterns and different fabrics so you should be able to get some um really similar they're supposed to have a waist um belt tie but i've um left that in my wardrobe so yeah i thought i'd pop on my pjs i think i'm just gonna snuggle up on the sofa and watch a christmas movie i've heard jingle jangle on netflix is really good but um, I just wanted to show you, I've tried to have a play around with the garland. So I popped the lights in one side that I got from the garden centre. I just need to pop the other side in and I'm really happy with those. They are only battery powered, which I think is amazing. And um, they do have different settings. So you can set them to like twinkle, to fade in and out and stuff. But I always just like the plain bog standard, <laughs> like a light light. So I don't like them like to be flashing and stuff and too in your face. Um, so I just need to do the other side. But I had to play around with the ribbon and you probably can see the mess that is made. And I'm really, really disappointed with it. It has just like molted everywhere. And if I show you, um, I kind of chucked it behind here with the <laughs> carrier bag. It has lost loads of its um, like coating around it. Um, so I started to tie a bow, but I'm just really, really disappointed in it. And it's not wired either, so I can't like manipulate the bows. Um, the bows on our Christmas tree are wired, so you can actually bend them into position um so i think unfortunately i'm gonna have to return them which i'm really gutted about i've just been having a quick look on amazon to see if i can find anything else um but i really really can't so um i think i might try a another garden center tomorrow or later in the week um if not i might just go back and get the rose gold ones that i did show you earlier in the video um if not i might just have to go for those um but i've still excuse the ring light um that was from filming the um me putting up the tree but um as you can see, all our boxes and everything from putting up the Christmas tree need to go back into storage. So, I don't know. I'm feeling a bit tired. I might see if um, Gav will be an angel and put them away for me. So, I will catch you guys later. And I will keep you updated with the garland situ... Ooh, zoom you in there. I'll keep you updated with the garden situation fingers crossed we can get this sorted Doesn't matter.